So I have to ignore chat because anything you say is two minutes behind me. And it's impossible to do anything. We are already in the pistol round. We are live here for the finals. And already two kills go out. Give a lock on who I can. Watching DJ next for Veritas. Moving up into market. Got a teammate there in the corner. Vance moving in. Jaeger taking out Link. Not sure how Vance didn't see him beforehand. But nice job right there. Taking out Nabble. So it's a 2v1. Trank U is all that's left for uh, Rubber Bandits. Vance with some seriously slick moves there. I love that. Catches him in the air. Uh, catches his... <laughs> I can't hear myself even think over these guys. I and turn the volume down, I think. Voice enable zero. <laughs> yeah, Vance there, catching him out on the right hand side, just uh, just prones, gets ready, and then brays that absolute deagle. I know it's an M1 911, but the recoil on that thing is, is dangerous. All right, here we but go. Yeah, Veritas nice take that. So they're going to choose the side they're going to start this final off. Yep. I'm thinking, back to the predictions, I'm thinking that Veritas will take this map 9-6. to six. I have I have a feeling. Deep inside me. 9-6, who do you think is going to take it? Mm -hmm. Veritas. Veritas. Mm-hmm. Okay. But it's going to be back and forth, I'm pretty sure. All right. All right. We are live. Here we go. And off to the races they go. Here on District. It is the finals. Round number one. Here we go. Watching Jaeger. He is on the move, busting through, about to pop through this window. Go up, up into the building. Bogey was a beast last round, last match. And he's going to camp inside this site. Kate moving in to B as well. Lustig able to take out Darth and Kate. So now it's a 3 5v2 in favor of Rubber Bandits. Yeah, a little too uh, aggressive on the start there, I think, from Veritas. They, uh, they actually sent two up into apartments and pretty, pretty much dis disregarded the top half of the map completely. And now it's a stalemate. Bogey's got almost three quarters of the cap on Bravo, and, and Vance and Next don't want to make a move. But I, I don't blame them either. They've got three man deficit. I can't see them bringing this one back, but if they can uh, create a couple of 1v1s, then it'll be easy enough for them. Stranger things have happened. Right now, it is a waiting game. Yeah, and don't worry in the chat, guys, about the uh, about the stream delay. Two minutes is is absolutely fine. Just gives a little bit of a an edge to the teams to make sure that they can't be stream sniping. Although I wouldn't see that from either of these teams. Have been playing for a long time now, so just just don't worry about it. Talk about the game instead. Yeah, it's gonna be a great game. So. And yeah, on the flip side, if you have to tell me something, I'm not going to see it for two minutes, so don't bother. <laughs> Let's talk about the game. Be happy. Okay? Don't worry. Be happy. Be All right. Happy. It looks like Veritas is slowly on the move. DJ next is moving up, looking down into B. Vance, meanwhile, heading upstairs ever so slowly. But remember, bandits have just about every inch of be covered but to be honest i think rubber van is looking at this they have every single a apart from balcony they don't really have eyes on balcony apart from nabal sitting in the cubby but if someone sneaks up on balcony there they're, they're gonna get a, a nice surprise but jaeger takes out next in the meantime so it's all on vance now they're, they're taking it i mean they have plenty of time but they made the move far too slowly less than a minute left now for vance to uh to clutch a 1v5 and he's coming out of cubby where he's going to have three guys staring right at him most likely. And during this time he's got to cover every single angle. 
And he missed one. And doesn't spot out Bogey. <laughs> yeah, he, Bogey, he missed one proned in the corner, seven. <laughs> pops his head like a zit. One to nothing. Favor of Rubber Bandits. I need cover to load. Yeah, I think uh, Veritas took that a little bit too quickly. They they sent two shooting up Apps and, and one down into uh, Bravo. As soon as Apps was down, they could uh, Rubber Bandits could put all their attention down onto Bravo since it was flashing and they just ripped him apart. <laughs> Straw pull for EU or NA, here we go. <laughs> Someone set it up. Let's get a let's get a serious prediction going. Come on. Let's do it. Is this for the map or is this for the entire series? Mm, the best of three. Uh, on the on the poll I mean. On the poll. Oh. We'll let, we'll let them decide. Yeah, Here we go, look, again, the, completely, Veritas completely disregarding one side of the map. Bogey is having a look over to uh, Cubby. He's not going to get any shots off the yet. And Kate sneaks out this time instead of going on Bravo and takes Bogey out. So Bravo is all open this time. Link trying to get the flank off, but Tranku is all over that one. And Vance is able to take Nabble down. Lustig and Kate in B. Tranku again making these rotations count and getting some good kills. But Ooh. Kate managed to get the trade. She pops back down before Lustig could get a shot off. Finally gets her through the wall and then finishes. DJ next through a barrier. But Jaeger able to finish off Darth for the win for um, Rubber Bandits. They go up two to nothing. Comms must have been perfect then for Lustig to get that shot through the wall. That was a great turn of play. It looked like Rubber Bandits were starting to fall apart with, uh, with getting hit from a couple of different angles. But thank you had that covered. And, and yes, we see them go case of up. Veritas won the pistol round. I'd like to see Veritas move more towards garage and balcony. I don't think that stacking one side of the map is really that great because Robo Bandits are taking advantage of it and just using the map control that they have. Uh, and with apartments, you can be seen so easily in those windows that even if you move from one to the other, they're expecting it. So I, I'd like to see them do so, but Nex is just going to... Well, I mean, they've got it covered by Nex, but it's still not a great play, really. Jaeger and Bogey both getting picks as well to begin with. Yeah, watching Bogey, he ran right in, picked a spot to prone in, and watched a door. And as soon as he popped his head around the corner, he squeezed off a couple shots, took him out. Meanwhile, Darth up top, trying to look down inside of B, just missing where Bogey is. But Bogey slowly... Making his way in to B. Watching a specific spot. Meanwhile, Darth overlooking, and now it's just kind of a standoff. Five to uh, three. Five V three, I should say. In favor of Rubber Bandits. DJ Next trying to move around. Lustig is waiting for him. Meanwhile, Bogey. He's deep, but if he keeps B. looking up at that hole. Darth planning to throw right a nade down barrel. inside of B. And it is gets Bogey who is sitting on B. Beautiful nade by Darth as Bogey goes down and Lustig waiting for DJ next in the flank. Gets him and Darth still looking down into B. Takes out Lustig. 3v2 now. Still in favor of Rubber Bandits. Shots going off. Trank U coming Darth into B now. Crazy spray across him. I should get Nabal on balcony. Ooh, Vance taking down Trank U. Now it's 1v3 in favor of Jaeger. 1v2, sorry. Jaeger trying to get around. He's going to go up inside of a building. Darth is up there. Vance is down inside of B. Jaeger slowly. Minute and a half remaining. This is the finals, Funk. Indeed. Darth is right yeah, Vance there. Vance now has to be very careful of Blue Room. Jaeger's going to come sneaking up on top of him. Yeah, he's going to. It looks like Darth leave. is going to come down and. Uh, oh, here we go. Watch his back. Oh, yeah, he's going to go for Charlie instead. That's a good play, really, because he knows it's going to be 1v2 v or 3. Depends on how good the comms are. With capturing Bravo, they can afford to send one straight to Charlie and one straight to Alpha. Veritas, however, did capture B, and here comes Link, DJ next, and Kate out of it. And Jaeger able to take out Darth. Let's see if he can finish this capture before Link gets there. Link's going to run right in. Gets the pre-fire, gives away the position, and Kate finishes off Jaeger. 
putting Veritas on the board, two to one. Let's take a look at this straw poll now. <laughs> While we are waiting. Oh my God, where'd it go? There it is. All right, let's see. Two, one, two, one, two, oh, two, oh. Results. We have four votes for Rubber Bandits winning two to one. Fair toss, two votes, two to one. One vote for Rubber Bandits winning 2-0 and no votes for a 2-0 Veritas win. Mm. So, That's interesting. I mean, Rubber Bandits have been strong, but Veritas have been strong for as long as we can remember. So I'm surprised that it hasn't been more uh, more close on the straw poll, but the rounds so far have, have been in Rubber Bandits' favor. Even that last one, it, it was very, very close up until the end when a couple of... Bogey once again able Real to push inside of B. Find a prone spot and just watch anything he can. Lots of shots going off up above. Kite pushing inside of B now. Starting to peek. Sees Bogey takes him out. Darth able to take out Nabo. Two quick kills by Veritas. And three. It's down to 1v5. Looking good for Veritas now. Jaeger moving up. Link. Moving inside of B, Jaeger pops around the corner and brings him down. And no, tries to run down the street and Vance pops out and pops him in the head with an AKM. It is a tie game, two to two. It looks like Veritas have probably got a, a hold in what Rubber Bandits are playing so far. I mean, Rubber Bandits haven't changed anything in the four rounds, whereas Veritas have been changing it ever so slightly uh, on the bottom half of the map. Sending different amount of people in different lanes, so... Rubber Bennett's just struggling to, uh, to dominate like they did in the first two rounds. Let's see if they change anything this round. Maybe push someone into uh, to tires uh, and take Link before he uh, comes around and catches Tranku when they rotate. Jaeger for Rubber Bandits leading the way. Leading the charge for his team. Link for his. Slash Wink over a little bit here. <laughs> Link running up into the top of the building here. Let's go look down inside of B. Free fires at Jaeger was waiting for him and brings him down. Meanwhile, Darth, who was right behind him, has to hit the ground to get underneath and push ahead to that uh, pre-fire spot, I guess. That crossfire bogey still in B, just locking it down, watching a doorway. Yeah, that, that, that point in apartments they keep trying and trying is not going to work because... The angle that Jaeger has is so much better than the apartments, guys. And Kate once and again pushing into B. Same spot gets Bogey. But Nabble able to trade off and take down Dark. 3v4 now. Has Lustig pushing into B. He's on the outskirts. Moving in, looking for it. Able to take out Kate, who is prone. Next pops around the corner, takes him out. And DJ next plants his butt on B. Waiting for that capture. Nabble trying to get a shot down into sight. Two people pushing in. One gets shot, they know they're coming, and DJ Next is still there, and he gets taken out by Nabble. Trank U trying to come in from behind. This is Jaeger right now. And he, and, nope. Vance goes down, taken out by Nabble. And a rubber bandit retakes the lead three to two. Yeah, a bit of sketchy play there. Some of the players on Veritas not quick enough to get the trades. Next, for example. Probably could have saved Kate's life if he was a little quicker, just to peek around the corner. And Link obviously going down within the first, what, 45 seconds of the round was just, it was just a free kill. They, they shouldn't be a, they shouldn't be going against Dark Window from apps because apps is so open. I mean, if they need to, they should send someone down main uh, and pre-fire the Dark Window just for that better angle. But apartments so far, it's just a, it's just a slaughterhouse. When they keep doing it, they're going to keep finding themselves one down, one man down every single round. So Bogey, watching Bogey, he got a good spawn. Off, and he is making his way into market now. And he's got a good spot to pre-fire that he hasn't looked just yet that way. He's actually looking where Kate usually brings him down. Here comes Kate pushing out, peeking ever so slightly. See someone up above, and they're able to dank down Nabble. 
Link just got one of the most delicious shots off onto Tranku there, but Jaeger is is ready for that rotate. Knows that he's going to be pushing hard after that, and now it's a 3v2, so Veritas do have the man advantage. In fact, make that two, because Vance takes Bogey down, so Jaeger now all alone, but they have no idea that he's coming all the way around through Garage. Next should be able to hear him any second, but there we go. Here's him. Spins around 180, but Jaeger is ready to take him. He's going to go up to the balcony, get some height advantage. And there's the call as Darth and Vance look that way, but Jaeger has already given them the slip. Moving all the round, Darth and Vance all looking the wrong way. They think he's going to go to C, but he's just flanking them both. They realize it, and now I've started to look in other direction as Jaeger slowly coming back. He's going to flank both of them. No! Gives them all the slip, heads to C! <laughs> that was awesome. Watching yeah, that on time. the mini map was hilarious. <laughs> all this time, though, Veritas haven't been able to to get on a point. And Vance is still watching for that guy from Garage. So I'm wondering if he thinks they're actually got the uh, the, the count wrong, and he's looking for a second player. Definitely possible. Jaeger able to take out Darth. Here comes Vance now. They know he's there. Let's see what they can do. Jaeger is... Oh, in the... Look at that how second. close that save is. Here we go. It comes down to this. Here comes a grenade. So now Vance knows where he is. He's going to go in for the kill and gets I Jaeger gets in the win. face. What a clutch play by Vance. Stopping oh. that respawn timer. I don't... I don't... I, I just... How? How? It seemed like Veritas had just thrown that round away completely with, with not capitalizing on the man advantage. Letting Jaeger, he actually ran from Garage all the way back around through Alpha Street and Main Street to Charlie. And in the entire time, they didn't move an inch. That was a close one. They should be, uh, <laughs> they should be thanking happy. someone for that. I don't know. <coughs> Gaben, maybe. <laughs> or Mikey. <laughs> Praise Mikey. Oh my goodness. Tie game 3-3. Three to three. Vance saves it for Veritas. Tying it up. Instead of uh, instead of going up 4-2, to two, it is still tied. 3-3. Three three. So here we go, yeah, Bogey. There's, there's two man. There's two man stack in two positions. Interesting. We're working out this fine because Darth is taking out Lusty. Put Lusty can move through Cafe. And Link as well taking Tranku for the second consecutive time, but Bogey's actually made his way over into this little corner. He's got great vision. Well, he's spotted Bogey. Out by Kate. Ooh, taking out Bogey. Nice shot. Ooh, but Link's taken out Nabble. Trying to toss a grenade. Explodes on his dead body. Jaeger trying to make a move for it. And he's able to slip in away from Link. He comes back. Repeaks it. Link was waiting for him. Veritas goes up four to three. That pre-fire was actually really, really good from, from Link. You know that coming out of upstairs, you're not going to beat someone that's watching it. So you, you, you pop down and you pre-fire, you've got every chance of actually making it a 50-50 battle rather than, I don't know, 80-20 in their, their favor. Wow. Yeah. Veritas just ruined <laughs> RP that round. It is. I don't know. The, the, the setup is very similar with the with the stacks, and apart from Veritas not sending anyone on B to begin with, and just stacking the bottom half of the map, it's it's very similar in in terms of uh, in terms of setup. But Robotics aren't really changing anything up right now because I mean, hey, if it, if it ain't broke, don't fix it. But it looks like it's starting to break, so maybe they should bring something new to the table. This time they are. Boogie's yep. gonna come straight through and maybe catch out Link on that that push. He actually gets uh, blocked by the box as well. Can't make shots count either. He's going to push straight up. Looks like taking Kate out, and Bogey could be on a mission here. He could be, he could fire off two or three right now if he gets this right. He's coming up right next to DJ. Oh, huge kill! Tranku and Bogey taking out Vance and Darth. Now Bogey is there, launching a grenade into market. It's a good nade. No one is there. <laughs> DJ Nex had run out into the market to try to cap it, and now he takes out Tranku by the kneecap, but Lustig up in a window takes down DJ Nex, and it is tied 
again at the half. Four to four. There you go. Rubber Bandits change one thing, one simple thing. Instead of Bogey going straight out to B, he goes through and runs straight through into Blue Room and just opens up the map. They were expecting that guy to be on Bravo again. Raritas set up for it, but didn't mean anything because no one was there to kill. That was a great play. Looks like we have a disconnect from Darth as well, so... Oh, he has to go to work. Uh, looks like we're going to have a quick pause at the half. And just, uh, Veritas just going to sub in Intrigue. Or Intrick. Is it Intrick? Intrigue? No, I'm the one that can't pronounce names. No! Ha! Ha! <laughs> Fanatics, <it>. what are you? <laughs> I, I think uh, it's... I'm joking. It's got to be Intrigue. It's yeah, a, it's, it's got to be Intrigue. That would be my guess. Yeah, Intrigue, Sargento. Now, well, this 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 could go in favor of Veritas. I mean, Darth is a very strong player, but obviously each player has something different to bring to the table, so it could actually be well in their favor, and it could surprise RB, but in the same sense, it could be detrimental for Veritas because... Intrigue just, you know, coming into a 4-4, very close half game. Can you get up to speed that quickly? We'll see. Yeah, Function saying that Inns is surprisingly a good game to spectate on this map anyway. Mm -hmm. I, agree. I agree. It's a great yeah. game. Such a good game to, uh, to spectate, but I just, I mean, once again, I just wish that we had a bit more spectators. I'm gonna throw that one out there, a little curveball. <laughs> It'll happen one day, but yeah, for the time being, it's still a great game. Mm -hmm. Take nothing away from it. No, so far, the, 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 the best matches so have come on this map. This one so far tied at halftime. And oh, the, this is the godfather of maps. The <laughs> FGC versus White Walkers match, which went down to the wire. 9-7, I think, was the final score. Yeah, I, I missed that game, unfortunately, but... It was fantastic. District always brings a good game, always. Hey, it's kind of it's kind of like the bread and butter of, uh, of Insurgency. Mid to close range. Just so good. <laughs> yeah, Function. Frag Team gets the, the WC final and you play a game you can't finish? Yeah. Well, I mean, I don't know. Who knows? It is 9 p.m. And it was time, you know, it was scheduled for 5 p.m. to 9 p.m. But that's GMT, of course. But it was scheduled for this time. So I guess, you know, that's, that's right on point for when uh, it should have been finished, I guess. I, yeah. I don't know. I'm just trying to give him the benefit of the doubt. <laughs> yeah, these things always happen, though. Got to make money. <laughs> Wait, money? Where's <laughs> yeah, mine? Yeah, it's another little curveball. Hey, why didn't you? Why didn't you give us? Some I mean, you money, can go to my Twitch Mikey. and send me <laughs> money. Absolutely. <laughs> and on that point, you can also do the same. My name is Forrest underscore INS, and I will take any donations. There's also a donate tab if you scroll down on the DGL <laughs> Twitch. Yeah, Just gonna throw that like out it. there. He's I think I'd get in trouble if I don't at least say that. <laughs> <sighs> But here we are, yeah. we are live on Restart. 25 seconds to go. Give a rundown of the rosters once again, just to re-familiarize here at halftime. It is tied four to four for Veritas. We have Vance, Kate, Link, DJ Nex, and Intrigue. And for a rubber band, it's Jaeger, Bogey, Lustig, Nabble, and Trank U. And your casters for this evening are Freaky and Forrester. Thank you. This message was brought to you by <laughs> Here we go, a tie game four to four. My goodness. Now we'll, we'll see if the uh, we'll see if the data is correct, and we'll see if insurgents really are the stronger side. If rubber bandits can we'll take uh, any advantage from this, I don't know. But look, see the, the setup is different completely. Nabil already rushing up through garage. No one on balcony, Oof. and Bogey takes out K to begin with on main B. She tried to go for the quick Bans cap. Bogey wouldn't have it. Great trade as well. Four on four. 
Link giving chase, cocking that grenade. Throwing it down. Not getting who is going after it was Bojki, who is just off to the left. No, oh, Link running up the stairs and oh, taking he him. Yeah, taking out Jaeger. Meanwhile, Intrigue sitting on this B spot as Bogey poked his head up for just too long and he kills it. Lustig able to take out Intrigue Vance, taking out Nabble. So now it is a 1v2 in favor of Veritas. Lustig taking out Vance, 1v1, DJ next, and Lustig is on the site. As yeah, he's shooting at the wrong box as well. Yeah, DJ Next trying to get him, gets him through the wall, and Lustig gets DJ Next 2v1. Lustig with the clutch play. <laughs> Five to four. Yeah, unfortunate on Treek there. Really great position. Takes uh, takes that RB player down on B and just opens it up completely, but. Of course, the guys have got his back, and Intrigue decides to uh, move position. Probably not the best choice, really, on, on Bravo, because it's so open. Just sit down. Even if you got to move, just prone. Prone it out, man. Come on. That's how EUs play. Oh, wait. You're NA. <laughs> I'm joking. Shots fired. Uh, it's fired. They've been fired for a long time. I know. Okay. It, oh, it exists in tribes, true. Believe me. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Believe me. Here we there's go. A, there's a lot of ammunition, dude. It's it's a light machine gun. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> I'll be in Europe for two weeks <laughs> okay. next year. Thanks, man. Thank you, welcome. All right, Kate running right in. Bogey yeah, taking him out. Two round. kills, three kills. And wow, this is quick. It. Link is stuck out here. That's what I was saying and earlier. Bogey. Just, but, oh, yeah. my goodness. You just got to pound that dark window from main, and you're, you're bound to get a kill, but... All down to the uh, the sub now, Intrigue. I mean, he, I think they have an idea where he is. But two players, they've just double peeked him. They knew exactly where he was. The process of elimination. And obviously they saw him from cafe earlier on, so. Or diner, I should say. Just to. <laughs> just to uh, accommodate everybody. <laughs> Six to four, rubber banding. Rubber banding. Rubber banding. <laughs> rubber bandit. <laughs> <laughs> God damn it. Six to four. They have the lead by two. Nine to win to take map number one. Second map is station or market? It'll be uh, market, I believe, for the second round, uh, second map. Uh, uh, yes. Sin and CIA are playing for third and fourth place right now. And the score is synergy is up four to one on map one. So there you are. Keeping you updated on all the scores as we are here, 6-4 to four, here in the finals, map number one. Watching Lustig running into B, taking a quick peek, coming out, taking his time. Oh, but not Looks enough like time Kate is... Oh, my goodness. Veritas returning the favor from last round. But what round. do you know? Bogey takes down Kate again. That's a really weak matchup for Kate right now against Bogey. Bogey just keeps getting those kills. But it's been taken down, so it's all down to Nabble now. And Nabble running. Link with... Was that an ace? No, four man. It's a four man. Kate snuck in a kill though. there as well. Link owning it up that round. Bada boom, bada bing. Jumps his score from seven and nine to eleven and nine. <laughs> Six to five, Veritas puts another one on the board. That's all it took. Oh, this this game is going to come down to those tiny little changes in play, because these these teams are full of players that are literally at the top of the game, like the best in the world for insurgency, obviously, through the World Cup. It's going to come down to those tiny changes in play. Oh, what a grenade from Link taking out Bogey on the run. And Jaeger taking out Intrigue. Lustig takes out Link. Kate takes out Lustig. Lots of firefight here. Lots of death. 3v2 <laughs> situation now. Jaeger coming down the street. He's going to run right into Vance, who gives him the slip. <laughs> they just went right around each other. 
That was fantastic. Jaeger now making a beeline for A, and he is going to sit on it. Vance giving chase now. No, he's going the opposite direction. As Nabble looks like he was I doing DJ next. That. Yeah, I there don't think they were, there we go. Now they realize yeah, Vance, it. Now. They're going to two-man this. This is smart. They know that yep. the B is probably uncontestable right now, so they're going to straight for Jaeger, which should come from two angles here, so... Trank U is going to get B, so there's the respawn. And, yep. Veritas able to take him out and keep A in their sights. But now it's a 2v4 situation. Vance slowly moving back to B. As Trank U watching all the angles, except for the one behind him. <laughs> <laughs> he ain't going to get down there, though, Bogey. He's going to be through uh, pretty shortly. And Lusty just looking for that. That's higher play, just in case they went for that, but not at all. Bogey does get spotted out by Vance, but a little bit slow on the reaction there. But will move. That's smart. He doesn't want to stay in dark window all round. Ooh. And they can close out the round. That's seven to five now in favor in favor of Rubber Bandits. <laughs> is it only me or Forrest's background sounds like there's an angry dog always growls? No, it's just me, man. No, I don't know. If it sounds bad, I'm sorry. I'll, I'll take it away from my mouth a little bit. I don't know what it could be. Maybe it'll be better now. Yeah, I don't hear anything. Sorry. Oh, that's okay. <laughs> Seven to five in favor of Rubber Bandit here. It's Darth Dog. He left the game to come over here and, and growl at me. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it looks like Veritas is going to take this very slowly this time. Going to cover all the lanes. Centrique with a perfect spray through the wall to get Tranko. That's apps opened up completely apart from Jaeger, who's already up here. Hello. Intrigue maybe knows about this already. Jaeger's going to push him. Intrigue needs to... He hasn't cleared it completely with that nade. He needs to know that. And he didn't. And doesn't, unfortunately. Jaeger taking him out. It is a 4v2 situation here. Watching Nabble, who's kind of caught in between them all. But coming up behind Kate. Just on top of her. Oh. Kate hiding in a smoke now. <laughs> The ninja play is coming out. Coming out, not sure. And Able to hit. To get what? Two. What? Come on. Ruined, but Nabble finishes her off. Now it's a 1v1 situation. Beautiful job by Kate. Now here comes DJ Next coming in. Doesn't see the, it. Oh, DJ Next plays. coming from behind. Oh my goodness. Oh, really MVP to really Kate for that, that round. Holy that cow. Just, oh, that made me go crazy. <laughs> wow. Jumps through out the smoke. Braze while jumping. Oh, that was just too good. It is five to three sin in the match for third place. That was insane uh. from Kate. <laughs> I thought she was completely lost when she came out of that thing. She just bam! Headshot! Bam! Killed the other guy. It was so quick. Was FPS fantastic. freaky, everybody. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Boom! Headshot! <laughs> that was too good. Oh, wow. <laughs> That's a highlight, everybody. Fuck. That was so good. <laughs> I, I can't. I'm going to dream about that later. Oh, and Link with a oh double my. spray across middle. That's, that's this round over, surely. And Kate. Whoa. And Link both doubling up on that. It's now 4v3. Uh, sorry, 4v1. I don't uh, what is math? <laughs> yeah, you're slowly moving in to be Kate is there. Pop out on Kate's There's the any Oh but Kate Doesn't just react to it, No Kate just stared at him. Might be a ping thing. You never know. Jaeger trying to go away. Link is waiting for him. Wrong yeah, he's, level, he's though. He's good on the... Uh, he knows, though. Link has heard those footsteps, and he's going to get him in the back. Yep. Vance is already moving to cover the street as well. Oop. 
Just missed it, but he's just seen GJ next takes, next takes him out. Down. Once he got into B, and it is now seven it, it's, to it's seven. Seems, like Veritas, they lost two rounds to begin with. Um, to begin uh, the, to begin the game, I should say, and then they brought it back, and then it's, it's very close. And then again, this happened. They they lose two rounds, and it looked like they're sort of faltering, but. Seems like they just need a couple of rounds to read the play, and then they they manage to match it up. Tie game. But now seven seven. seven. Yep. Anyone's game. It's yeah. this is insane. <laughs> La Revolution. Go RB. <laughs> I think they're German, man. Link <laughs> again with that spam, taking out Nabble. Yeah, and Lustig as well, waiting for it this time. That's smart play, not to give him an extra kill. But he may run straight into Nex, who has the... With, with all that time, but Nex, just the timing. The timing was perfect for Lustig then. That could have been uh, this entire side of the map completely open for them. Jaeger in B takes out Kate, who is camping it. Link trying to move up. Jaeger able to take out Kate. Bogey is there trying to look through smoke as Link walks in. Look out. Right in the face. Takes him out. He moves up. Trying to go after Intrigue, who's right there. There's the peak. And boom. Bogey brings him down. It is now 4v2 in favor of Rubber Bandits. Nice precision shot from Nex onto Bogey, but has a second on his left, and also Jaeger to deal with on B, but no chance at all, and Tranku takes down Vance, taking down Balcony Stairs. 8-2-7, one win away from a map number one win, a best of three. Oh, this could be an the overtime, finals. they've got to bring it back now. Yup. I'd love to see an overtime. Uh, speaking the first of which, one would be the final. Speaking Come of on. Which, let's, uh, okay, here we go. Uh... But you gotta be sleeve. The straw poll. Eight <laughs> votes for rubber bandits. Two, uh, two to one. I just dropped the straw poll in chat, so vote away. It's a lot more people in chat now to vote, so vote, vote, vote. Have a fun. There's the scores. Rubber bandits needing just one win to take this map number one. Here in the finals. And here we go. Let's see what Link goes for the pre-spam, but someone beat him to it this time. Trying to go for it again, but it's through. Meanwhile, Intrigue and Bogey are very close to each other. Intrigue tossing a grenade. Bogey knew it went off. Intrigue is moving away. DJ Next is chasing somebody. Nabal able to get... Oh! Oh, I hit Hip fires him. Nabble was able to get uh, Kate, who was in B again, but TJ next chases Nabble down. And now it is a 4v3, and again in favor of Rubber Bandits. And now they slow down. It just looks like they're all just watching flanks now because the the man advantage, they, they have no idea where the next person is, but Vance takes down Bogey on barrel. So it's a 3v3, and they're all, they're all bunched up right now for Rubber Bandits, apart from Jaeger, who just beelines for Bravo. And he is sitting on it now. And we'll see. DJ Next has a, has a grenade spot. Doesn't get him. But they do get a kill. Oh, Tranky goes down. Oh, Jaeger pops up. Able to take out Intrigue. But Vance was there. And guess oh, what, folks? Late. We're going to OT. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Vance will start the show in that last round. And it's pink bikini. What is it? A best oh. of six, I think. Uh, yeah. Okay. So uh, best it looks like we're just gonna go for a overtime. We're just restarting the map, so we can get this overtime played. Restart the scores. Of course, map one in the finals goes to OT. Could we have every map to OT? I don't want to jinx it. But... What's really funny is everybody doesn't want OT. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm sorry, guys. It's happening.
Yeah, it's the best of six format. It's uh, three rounds each side, and it'll be the first of four who wins. So it's anybody's game again. Completely even as well, four on each side. As in four, four on insurgents, four on security, not like a five-three or anything like that. Incredible game so far. Yeah. I am loving it. That goes without saying. <laughs> <coughs> <laughs> Both teams are the winners. Yeah, let's just call the final right there. 8-8 eight, eight is fine. Don't worry about it. Actually, I got to play a game at PAX that I really enjoyed. It's called Secret Ponchos. It's a 3v3... Uh, God, over-the-top twin-stick shooter. Really fun. Really well done. Awesome graphics. We're live here in 10 seconds. But when the, was that a quick the time, <laughs> well, was, when the time when that? the time goes out and there's no winner, it doesn't say there's no winner or it's a tie. It says both teams are winners. Oh really? <laughs> yeah. I uh, yeah. In the spirit of the game, I yeah. suppose that's good. But <laughs> what, what does that really bring to calm? <laughs> it just made me laugh when I oh, saw it. Oh, it's fine, guys. All right, here it's, we it's... go. It is overtime. First of four, and this time a rubber bandit bogey. bogey. Not doing what he usually did. <laughs> He's actually going. He might be meeting well, Link here. Well, this worked here. in the last round. Remember, they they managed they to tie it up. Oh, Vance. but Vance Peaks. taken Vance out, shots. taking him out. Wow. Yeah, look at this change from Veritas as well. They've got two people r rushing up garage this time, and Link doesn't actually manage to get that shot off on Lustig. I really didn't expect that. Link just seemed to maybe the the grenade uh, smoke was was covering his his vision, but it was unfortunate. They could have had a five five on three advantage there, but Lustig smartly back straight off just in case there's another one. Looks like they may uh, know that Veritas like to double up on each position, so good play from Lustig. Now we're just waiting on who makes the first move for Bravo. Yeah, and as Sam said in the chat as well, it's gonna. Well, we're obviously behind on the on the stream, unfortunately, but then win nine to four, so that makes Sim third and CIA fourth. Yep. Still waiting for either team to move. I'm just watching the mini map right now for the first real movement. Someone's gonna have to yeah. go for it eventually. We'll see. Maybe a minute thirty. We'll see them change it up here. Minute 30? Nothing? No. Nope. Yeah. Oh, well. Uh. Oh, Jaeger. Getting ready for a spam spot. <laughs> Aiming right for DJ and X. Oh, just off. I think this could actually favor Veritas right now with Nex having that player slightly out of position in, in terms of his team. Whereas uh, Ruben is doing this nice line across the map. Nex seems to have that, that sneaky position. Might be able to take Lustig out and get the advantage but I mean Lustig is, is, is aware of that but next now rejoining his team by the looks of things no one really no one wants to make a move right now mm -mm. I it mean they got all the time in the world with the uh, the extended infinite time but this is for the final so why not? I don't... Uh, yeah, exactly. I'm not surprised. Take every advantage you can. Link and Bogey must be going crazy sat here watching this, though. Yup. DJ Nix is so slowly early in the on the move. Yeah, they've been dead since the beginning of the round. <laughs> Come on, guys. I want to play. Now, this, this, in my opinion, is on Nex. If he can sneak up and maybe take out Nabil, who... who I imagine we'll likely make a move out onto Balcony at some point. 
If you can just sneak up and take him out from the side, then that's the play I can see changing this round. But at the moment, nothing's really going to change this unless they, they really do all just go ham. That's right, I said ham. All right, here we go, infinite time. Oh, we have Jaeger doing a little movement. Just trying to find that perfect angle. Oh, wait, 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 Vance is peeking. Fast. Vance is peeking, but Jaeger was able to go back and hide. Yeah, the parallel right now, they never going to see really each other. Any teams person. are just ghosting the stream. We got to wait two <laughs> minutes, guys. <laughs> now, all Neville needs to do right now is just pop up and he should be able to get a headshot on Vance, but no one, again, oh, there we go, Lustig's finally made a move, but can't make that up, he's never going to penetrate that that wall on the side there. Something's happening. <laughs> Vance is stuck, is and Vance DJ now. Next is actually coming up the stairs trying to flank Lustig here, or uh, Nabble. Lustig's, Lustig is down below. Here comes DJ Nex. Now Jaeger has every idea where Nex is, so unless Nex is going to make a beeline for A, which might be the best play right now because Nabal is stuck nowhere near the windows. Yep, DJ next, trying to get a shot off here. It looks like Lustig is itching to make a move. Mm -hmm. He's the only player that's really been making that move. I mean, next has been sneaking around, but... He's moving up now. Nabble's still in the same spot. Everybody taking it so slow. I think Tranky shot himself in the foot with a tranquilizer dart. He hasn't moved in about five minutes. <laughs> Literally, he is still looking for the hasn't. exact same grate in this yeah, gate. Indeed. Yeah, Jaeger and Tranky have got this. We got this shots going off. Lustig. Down, but... Lustig. Oh, going through market now. Made a move. Vance doesn't want to stand DJ up Next is on the move now, trying to come up. Kate is still there. Lustig has a better view now. And DJ Nex has moved up. Let's see if he can get a shot off here. Nabble finally, here come the kills. DJ Nex trying to get a shot off, but finally taken out. Nabble taking out Kate. And look out in his face. Look out. <laughs> Nabble. Dan's right on top of him. Yeah, he did. DJ Nex doing river dance on top of Nabble. Nabble gets the kill. And a rubber bandits take the lead one to zero here in OT for map number one. That was so intense. I, oh, wow. Just both teams took it so cautiously. And Lustig just could not wait any longer, but they get the win, so he is forgiven. <laughs> Disgusting, but yeah. Oh man, all right. So one to nothing in favor of rubber banding here. First to four here in overtime. <clears throat> Makes me laugh every time you say rubber banding. Rubber bandit. Damn it. Oh, Bogey was set up for it. He gets the kill on Link who just tried to rush it. Ooh, but Vance got the kill on Bogey. Lusty. This is the thing. It's just like rubber bandits know that they like to double up on these spots, but then they seem to forget it. And they move position after they get that first pick. So, doesn't really do any favors for them right now. But Tranku is set up all the way down the other side of the street. And Vance catches him out. That was a great spot by Vance. Now, Jaeger's going to have to move off his uh, dark window position. But Vance is already making moves into apartments. So, again, we're going to see a bit of a stalemate for a while until someone makes a move onto a point. 
Lustig is actually in a very, very... Well, it's, it's a dangerous position if someone comes through in a cafe and says... Ooh, Nabble! What a shot across the market on Intrigue. And Jaeger able to take out Vance. Down, down, 3v2 in favor of Rubber Bandit. <laughs> rubber Bandit, get damn it. you get there. Rubber Bandits. Rubber Bandits. It's plural. There's five of them. Five of the little condoms. It seems as if we've taken a change in play completely from the actual game. Mm -hmm. It was so action filled in that 8 8 ha well, 8 half game. And now we just have this stalemate for the entire round. And there's like no reaction once there's a pick apart from at the start of the round when Vance got the two and nothing else. DJ next moving up, Good trying to. Though. Ooh, but it's gonna miss. Nabble returns the favor. He's gonna land short, and he runs away. And you're, there goes Jaeger going Jaeger's for B. Jaeger's no longer in dark window. Jaeger going for B. Let's see if Kate goes for the peak. However, Lustig is watching that area. So as soon as she peeks, tries to toss a long grenade. Ooh, that was close. Not able to get it though. Kate, Kate comes out of B, and he'll shot in the face. And Lustig takes out DJ next. They take the lead two to nothing. Rubber Bandits are Euro and Veritas is mostly NA. All, well, some Canadian, but it's all in a Canadian A. All right, two to nothing in favor of Rubber Bandits. Damn it. <laughs> Give a rundown of the scores there. Jaeger and, and Nabal are leading the way right now. No deaths. And here we go. Bogey doing what he did in the first part of the match. He's camped up. There's already someone there pre-firing that corner, trying to get somebody. It's going to be Vance, I think. Yes, indeed. And here comes yeah, Kate. Yeah, with Bogey coming through the highest. Oh, was... Kate didn't see Bogey, who was just kind of prone there in the corner. She gets wasted. Link there to take down Bogey. Trying to watch his back. Nabble still in the same spot. Jaeger. Slowly moving up. Link might be ready for him. Meanwhile, Trank U still in that same spot. Watching flank. But it is four to three in favor of Veritas right now. Let's see if they can keep it that way. Jaeger. Yeah, I agree with what Casey was saying there that Veritas need to keep on with the aggression because when they do it works. They might lose one or two players, but... Oh, here we go. Link making a move on Nabal. Nabal heard it. Grenade. <laughs> oh, Huge grenade man. coming out from Link right there. Taking him out, and Link is on the move. Looking for Trank U somewhere around here. There he is. And Link with the kill. Jaeger all alone now for Rubber Bandits. Can Veritas get on the board here? He's going to run into DJ next, but Jaeger turns at the last second. Shoots him in the face. Now he's on the run, making a beeline for C. And I don't think Vance realizes that. He does now, but he's going to... He's too late. And Jaeger... Yeah, Link straight away goes to go. Alpha. That's, this is the play that needs to happen. One yep. on A, one on B. And Vance and making Vance his way to Jaeger. Let's see fight to him. And I don't think he's ready for Jaeger around this corner. He wasn't. Jaeger takes out Vance. He's going to be able to get that cap on C and bring back their team. Link is nice going you. straight to the spawn. He's going to kill what he can. And only one went that way. Gets one, but the other three took off the other direction. And now here comes Veritas, Vance, and Kate out of... But in the meantime, Intrigue Kate. takes down Jaeger, so it's it's actually gone in their favor because Link can now set up again. Mm-hmm. 
and he stops Tranku and Nabal from crossing the street. They don't want to cross in case he's going to get taken out as well. And now Veritas is capping C. 32 seconds remain. Nabal out in the street, run, about to run into Link. Link's looking the wrong direction. Logi runs right into Kate, though. Just outside B, not going to happen. Intrigue taking out There's just no Nabil. time left. Nope, no time for Trank. All alone. Link's going to see him in about two seconds, and there is the kill. Veritas on the board, 2-1 to one here in OT. First to four for map number one. That's the half. That's the half? I thought it was first to four. Uh, well, it is, oh. but it's six. Uh, six rounds, oh. so best off six. So you uh, you swap at the half. I see, I see, I see. So, in, in other words, Veritas need to win all three rounds on the uh, insurgent side. Uh, sorry, on the security side to to have any chance of winning this now. Otherwise, you know they they can get to a course and we can go to a, another overtime or a sudden death, depending on what the decision is. But yeah, at the moment it looks like Veritas need to bring it out and. Stick with their aggression, I think, and replicate that last round, and I think they'll be uh, they'll be onto a winner. But the rubber bandits we saw when they when they sh went over to the insurgent side, they switched for the first time uh, in the main game. They they were winning rounds so easily to begin with. It took very tough some time to get going, just like it did there. They they lost two rounds before they got the one, so. Maybe Veritas can take the momentum with them this time. If not, it looks like Rubber Bandits will be taking this first map. Intrigue needed to change his undies. Awesome <laughs> <laughs> shy on this team. <laughs> <laughs> the Germans love it. Uh, we are live. Here we go. Second half of OT. Rubber Bandits up two to one. Veritas <laughs> just blocking completely in spawn. That's going to ruin their uh, the chances of getting a quick, quick pick. I'm sure unless Link has anything to do with it. Not able to get it. Jaeger set up here. New grenade was coming. Untreak is so close to this. Oh, Jaeger able to take him out, but he wasn't ready for Intreak, who was there as well. Tranku yeah, was not take ready out for Tranku. They're adopting the Veritas play of doubling it up. And quickity lickity splitty, it's 4 to v one Favorite rubber bandits, Vance is all alone now. Yeah, in this position, Vance just needs to go for it, really. He, he can't waste any more time because they're going to capture beer in any second. There it is. Yeah, and here comes Jaeger back into the game. 5v1 now. Vance in a lot of trouble. Yeah, can't see Rubber Bandit's giving him too many 1v1s here. They might send one or two players towards him, but uh, as soon as as soon as one or two go down, if so, they'll just they'll just camp it out and, and watch their angles. Bogey trying to get a lead, a lead on Vance here. Vance coming back and shot in the face by Bogey. So Rubber Bandits, one win away from taking this. Map number one. I think I'd like to see more grenades coming out from Veritas to begin with, with how aggressive Rubber Bandits can be going mm. on to Bravo. Just throw one or two towards uh, 
like Cubby and Porch, you know, the Barrel, maybe Main Bravo. I think they could be on for on onto a winner there. But again, Tranku and uh, Jaeger splitting up in apartments to double that up. Hey, he's actually going to make that suicide run down Main Bravo, but thinks otherwise. Link is so close to the other side as well, but Lucy's ready for that one. And three kills to begin the round. Looks like Rubber Bandits are taking this map. Unless Vance and Intrigue can say anything about that. Vance watching down over B. Sees someone. Fires. Lustig goes down. Bogey, meanwhile, looks like he's trying to flank. Flashbang goes off. Vance is right there. Has to duck from Bogey's fire. Jaeger has captured Bravo, so back into the fray comes Lustig. Jaeger on site. Does spot out Intrigue as well. Yep. Intrigue's got to be very careful here. If he makes one step, nope. there we go. Jaeger Down takes him. We're down to Vance again versus five. <laughs> yep, 5v1 again for Vance. Man loves the clutch. Not looking good. Bogey slowly creeping up behind him. They all know where he is as well. Bogey's just slowly making that move. It could actually be in Vance's favor if... He, like I say, he needs to make as many 1v1s as possible. If he takes a fight versus two or more, he's he's down. He, more than likely, Rubber Bandits are going to get the trade. Bogey there we go, Bogey's for... ready and waiting. Map 1 Bogey, goes to Rubber map. Bandits. Look at that, 4-1 to one in OT. That was crazy. Now Veritas really need to bring their A game and stamp their authority on on the market. Otherwise, you know, if it's a close game like that, Rubber Bandits could take the momentum, and they're probably thinking, "Well, there's a close game on District, but we took in overtime." So I'm imagining uh, Veritas will will come out fighting pretty hard right now. We are on market. It's a completely different map, though. It is. And oh. I, it's not one I have casted, so this will be fun. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, well. Here we I think I casted, one like, the maybe <laughs> one, one map of it in that tournament It is a, a great, ago, great map. But... It and looks like they want to change like over to uh, an EU server. All right, we're going to switch out of here, get in the other server. Yeah, I'll uh, I'll pop over there and I'll get the information for you. I already got it. Oh, good, good. I have already used it this afternoon. Oh, God, gosh, good, good one, sir. <laughs> Just a good show, yes. Oh, I do say. <laughs> Get the map changed over, and then we'll be good to go as soon as all of the players are in and ready to go. Look at that, look how quick you are. Damn, you're fast, son. Got some Nikes or something? No, just a really disgusting computer. <laughs> oh. <laughs> disgusting in a really good way. Yeah. I think I was watching you on Siege yesterday, and you said about the skyboxes. How they just, uh, as, soon as, you, as soon as you leave them, they just go, Oh, nope, no map here. Sorry. Yep. It's a blank screen. <laughs> on, uh, on market, it goes black or blue. Like, fully blue. As if you got a blue screen, you're like, No, my computer's dead. <laughs> and you realize it's like waiting for players. You're like, um, maybe I'm I okay. got all white. <laughs> yeah, it's I white. think it depends where you go. Depends where uh, you go. I don't know. I've gone up, side, bottom. 
<laughs> and now I'm lost. So there we go. <laughs> so lost, I didn't know where I was. Alright, we're just waiting for one more player from either team. We'll get the show on the road. Wonder if uh, we'll, we'll be seeing any sniper action. I mean, this this map is literally known for, for sniping all the way down the street, but neither of these teams really have an out-and-out -out sniper, uh, as, as far as I know. I mean, uh, yeah, again, Link has a awful ping of 230, but... Hopefully that's okay for him. I, I no, I don't think I've ever played with a ping like that. Apart from an Australian server where I had 350. Look at <laughs> Nabble with a but, seven ping. Yeah, Good this Lord. this server is uh the server is located in in Holland. <laughs> All right, let's take a look at the straw poll. 12, still 12 volts for rubber bandits. And then two, two to one. Huh. Well, we'll see. Yeah, good shout from uh, Enfint. It's going to be a slow play on C for both sides. Probably not a lot on A, unless people are, uh, are down and we're looking for a clutch play. Uh, it's going to come down to B. He thinks Veritas will smoke B and rush, and Rubber Bandits will play harder on the flanks and bridges, kind of mm -hmm. stay back on B. That's that's a very good shout. It is a very good shout. A C is kind of a it's kind of no man's land on this on this map. With you saying you haven't really played it or casted it, it's it really is. Not many people really will will defend C. Um, they they will off on the side. You know they'll they'll rush through C as insurgents or security will will watch from the street through the uh, uh, through the skinny archway around uh, these little white pillars. But it's it's not often you'll see anyone sort of rush up. It's just so open and you can be spotted from. Uh, from Africa or school, depending on what call you use, which is the the, the building off Yellow Bridge, where the Nova ice cream stall is. But yeah, it's going to come down to the flanks this time. Can't imagine there'll be too many stalemates like we just saw. It'll it'll all be down to. Uh, Whoever can hold the main street down Bravo the best, and whoever can use those flanks to their advantage. Yeah, these pings are ridiculous. Yeah, I'm not really sure we should be playing. I like. It was very, very close before. I mean, not close, but it was at least people were. More than this. Sort of a, 80 I mean, to 100. Play, make a plan on your a Euro server. You're basically asking Link to play across the U.S. or the, across the world. <clears throat> Holland is not the U.K. <laughs> At least, yeah. Make a play on a London server or something. <laughs> I don't actually know if we have any hosted in London that are ready and updated with the DGL uh, DGL specs, so I'm not Go sure on. if we can do that. Well. <laughs> we might switch back to the other server. Well, it's down to Veritas whether they want to or not. Um, but... Yeah, I, I, I just I just said that it, this seems very uneven with the pings. Everyone is at 200, bar Kate, who has 165. <laughs> oh, 
Well, we'll see. Uh, I think it's probably better if we do switch, but it's uh, it's down to it's down to them. Get a serve <laughs> in China for fairness. <laughs> Don't worry, boys. I'm sorry about the uh, the delay, but you know it's going to be a good game. So true that. Just wait for it. Just wait. It's going to be worth the wait. That looks like Veritas. Do you want to stay? So I would have thought. Uh... Well, we'll see. <laughs> All right, live on restart. Restart for pistol round. Nabble, look at my pig. My pig is amazing. <laughs> I don't think I've ever had this before. But yeah, two hundred V ten is is kind of uh, well, actually two hundred and thirty. Mm -hmm. The ten is it? I don't, I don't know. <sighs> <laughs> wow, Bucky. <laughs> Kate's, Kate's pink keeps improving, probably playing on a ship in the middle of the ocean, sailing closer and closer. <laughs> oh, all right, so we're live here for map number two. It's going to be market. That was great. Pistol uh, round. He's in a sub. Knowing Kate, it would be a sub, not a ship. <laughs> My secret. Oh, God, what did he say? Oh, uh, well, it looks like it's uh, going in their favor so far. They've got two picks to uh, start My this pistol round. My secret submarine layer. <laughs> My secret submarine layer. There's another pick from Jaeger onto Link, so... Still advantage with Nex taking that other. Jaeger taking down Vance as well. It's so a 2k for him so far. Nabal is sitting on B, capping this, but Kate is... Uh... Kate does have the advantage with three-quarter cap, but every time she, t she comes off... Nabal's gonna get a little closer. And Shriek goes over to Charlie to try and cap that as well, and oh my God. yeah, you just knows there's a guy in shops, catches there him out we as well. Go. So it's a three K. He's he's going for it this round, but Kate is able to take down Nabal. So yeah, you will contest B with it being very close to being capped, but Intrigue is going to get a free cap on Charlie. So soon enough, it's going to be a five v one, and Kate isn't going to make a move. It's a very smart play. Yeager has to make the play. And he Ooh. does indeed, he's got four. It was going to be a 5k, now he needs to get a 9k. Oh, he's had a bullet, it's the Makarov. Oh. Again, he's completely out of bullets this time, <laughs> he used them all. And that's my, uh, that's why you should not use the Makarov, my friends. Uh, you're here all week, Mr. Whisper. Well, uh, I hate to tell you, but it's Sunday, and Sunday's nearly over. <laughs> so, <laughs> you're not here for long, man. <laughs> I right, will see if they choose to switch or stay after winning that pistol round. Did come close with Jaeger uh, pulling out some really good plays, but like I say, using that Makarov, oof. Why would you?
Not live. So you know. It was really funny just to hear the click, click, click. <laughs> <laughs> it was, wasn't it? Click, click, reload. He has two bullets left in the other clip. Then click, click. Mm, okay. Nah, M M9 is the way forward. 15 bullets. I mean, come on. <laughs> so map number two is going to be market. Same roster as before, but we're going to run it through anyway. So for Veritas, we have Vance, DJ, Next, Intrigue, Kate, and Link. And over for Rubber Bandits, we have Trank, You, Jaeger, Lustig, Nabble, and Bogey. Map number two, mark it. Rubber Bandits did win map number one, and they need to take this one to take it. But if Veritas can find a way to win this one, we're going to go to a third map. And I'm starving. <laughs> not, not long now, my friend. I know. Oh, Bogey taking out Vance. Lots of kills coming out for Burber Bandit here. Link yeah, that Charlie side of the map completely open, and they've got no presence on Bravo now. If Link pops himself up on Blue Bridge as well, it's he's going to be under a lot of fire. It's just going to be so tense. I really didn't expect this kind of a stalemate. I thought there'd be uh, clashing heads in the lanes quite early on. Even though it's medium range to long range fire, I, I really thought they would be uh, a lot closer than this. Well, halfway through the rounds, Rob, Rubber Bandit's just going to take it nice and slow now. They have that two man advantage. Bogey slowly moving up to Alpha. Next, really, I mean, he has three different. Angles to cover, and it's gonna be very hard for him to find this player when he when he does spot on. Lustig pushing up a little too much. Kate getting the kill. There we go. Link does just try his best, and that was a suicide mission. Uh, next moves off Alpha, so that's a free cap for Bogey now. Just onto Kate, who's under fire already. Has good cover from the smoke and is going to rush up. Does take down Nabal. That's a great pick. But Jaeger is on Yellow Bridge still to take that trade. And that's a, well, very good round from Rubber Bandits. Indeed, one to nothing. From map number two, first to nine. Let's see if Fairtoss can figure it out. I really, to be honest, nothing really went wrong for them. They just, they didn't get unlucky, but Rubbermans were just too quick on the picks. So I'd be interested to see if they change things or if they just give it another shot with it being so early in the game. Link going for that smoke on Bravo again. And Intrigue actually getting a pick all the way down the street. That's a great start, but Lustig is already pushed up. Cool bogey, double kill by A. He's going to go for it. Kate sitting on B now. Lustig going to come out in the street. Oh, nope, taken out by Intrigue. Look bogey. at Bogey's position, Oof. though. They, they have no idea where he is, and Intrigue likely running into his, his crosshairs any sec. Tranku does have a hold on A already, and no one is close to contest that, so Intrigue instead is going to go for Charlie for that. Bogey and Kate are looking at each other just about. Overlooking B. Intrigue does is gonna get C. But here comes rubber bandits. Trank you able to get A. And Bogey with a beautiful shot on Link. Now it's down to Kate and Intrigue. Intrigue gets the cap, and here comes the rest of his team. He's able to get out in time. Fire back! And Bub out, take out Nabal, who's coming to kill him. Clear it up, not gonna happen. Link in a fire with Trank U. Trank.
Thank you, looking the wrong way. Here comes Link. Gonna meet him right there. Oh, Link gets him. And DJ next was waiting for it. Lustig and Bogey were able to take out Kate, watching over B. And Lustig able to take out Intrigue running down the street. DJ next moves to A, trying to get the capture. Here comes Lustig. Trying to meet him by the train station. Pulling out, trying to get a better view on it as Lustig runs into the warehouse. DJ next doesn't know Bogey is just chilling on the other side. He captures B. Now he knows. Firefight between Lustig and DJ next here. Not there. Here comes Bogey from the side. I'm not sure if he's... Oh! Lustig gets DJ next. And Bob Ow, it's 2 nothing in favor of Rubber Bandits. Yeah, again, I'm really not sure what Veritas really can do any better here. They're getting all the, the, the picks at the start of the round. They had all the map control. Intrigue was in charge of Charlie, but Tranku just did so much on the spawn killing. Although he only got the... Well, he didn't get any kills, but he, he did so much... Uh, in terms of delaying them getting out of spawn that Link and Nex couldn't get anywhere near to help out Kate and uh, Kate and Intrigue. Alright, here we go. Here comes the grenades down Main Street. Veritas pushing B hard this time. Link taking some damage. Uh, this time Veritas is just rushing through Bravo, but Nabal is set up and ready for that one. Next takes down Bogey, and also K is spotted out by Nabal, but that chopper is just with too much cover. It's coming out! Had to run. Jaeger and Nabal take her down. Taken out, look at that. Clean up work. Yeah, Ruban, it's on these flanks right now. That I mean, they're not even flanking. They're just using that flank lane at the start of the round so well that they, they're getting behind Veritas <laughs> in a minute. A minute into the round, and Vance had already run in front of Lustig. That shouldn't happen. Yeah, ba -bow. You sound like that, uh, the CS caster on ESL. Me? Like, pa pow! Chicken oh. kill, cuckoo. I don't know if you know that. No. Some people will get that reference, but you're uh, you're creating a trend, my friend. What, what, what can you do, though? That I stole from another tribes caster about 12 years ago. No, no, don't don't say it. Don't say it. That's oh, fine. no, we all, we all share and steal. <laughs> it, it, there's no way around it. It is inevitable. Anyway, Intrigue, trying to learn into Lustig here in just about two seconds. They're looking the right way. Bogey, the same. Link's on a serious flank now. He needs to check his right-hand side, otherwise Tranky's going to get another free kill. Looks like he will is. indeed. Trank moving back to A. DJ Next coming out of it. Ooh, he was waiting for that. Trank U gets DJ Next clearing A. Vance has to move around and get to A. And Bogey gets him. Nice job by Bogey. Bogey sealing off A. Now Kate is all alone. Gets shot in the back by Nabble. And once again, Rubber Bandits in command up 4 nothing. It's surprising, really, because I don't think that the ping has really taken effect right now. Every kill from Rubber Bandits is... There hasn't really been any 1v1s, you know, aim battles. It just all seems that Rubber Bandits have just got better positions and they're getting the, mm -hmm. getting the picks on Veritas without Veritas even really knowing where they're getting shot from. 
and Kate and Link doubling up with a grenade onto Naval, but Jaeger's ready and waiting for Link. Lustig had a shot on Kate, but he looked the wrong way. Now looks the right way. Shoots Kate in the back. She goes down. Vance. Oh, Tarrant Gu gets him in the face. Intrigued now. Trying to come through. He's about to get shot in the side by Lustig and does so. Bada boom, it's 5 nothing now. Yeah, really unexpected. I knew, I knew it'd be. Uh, I well, I thought it'd be very close, but this is just going complete whitewash right now. Completely unexpected. But with the, I mean, uh, like I say, with the ping, I, maybe, but just can't see how Baratas can get back into this game with the way they're playing. They don't seem to be changing anything up. Seems to be running head first into Bravo and just giving free kills away. This time it's Vance that wins that aim battle, so. Bogey with a pre fire, but Vance sees him, takes him out. Whew. Nice job by Trank. You taking out Vance from behind. It ran into Link, though. <laughs> 2v2 now. Link just doing his thing. <laughs> I don't really see how uh, how or why he needed to jump on top of the yellow bridge like that right there. I mean, obviously he was trying to jump on top of Nabble, but no need for that. He just gave it away. Now it's all on next now. Kate has two people hunting out. Oh, he out fell. For her. Oh, Lustig fell off the bridge, but able to catch Kate from the side. I think Vance has just thought he killed him as well, but mostly hasn't. Now does. Now he should know from earlier on that the player was right below him, but... Oh, he nice does so! Pick. Dial points. However, they did get the four. cap in time. That was close, though. That was super close, but now DJ next. Gonna try to cap B. Not sure if he's gonna get it in time. Lustig is... Oop, there in time close. and shoots DJ next in the face six to nothing now I think I'd like to see them push somewhere else than Bravo I don't, I don't see how they're gonna get anywhere on Bravo when they, they've I mean they should take six rounds as an indication that it's not working. We'll be pushing Alpha. I mean, Link actually did get a lot of ground on Alpha, but just didn't check that one angle that Tranku was sitting at. And Tranku got a free kill on Link. So if they if they do the same thing again, then they should surely, uh, surely win out on Alpha. But then they're still not trying it. It looks like they're still going for the same tactic on Bravo. And maybe they're adamant this is the, the tactic that works. But right now they're playing for... Well, they're playing for nothing. A shot by Nabal getting Link. Kate also in B. Ah, just lots of kills coming out for Burger Bandits. Pre frying the bridge. No damage done. Ouch, That's F1. a perfect grenade right <laughs> yeah. in the face. Jaeger getting Kate with an F1, so no dice there. DJ next, all that's left. Whoa, getting shot from just about everywhere. 7 to 0. Yeah, and as people say as well, v Veritas are a very good team on 
on this map. So it's it's surprising to see that they are getting outplayed. This is do or die really now. If they get an 8-0 half, it's, there's no way back from that. They don't have anything on the other side. I mean, not that one, uh, not that one round will really give them any sort of uh, advantage on the other side. But Vance starts off well against Bogey, just like last time. But let's see if they can make it happen this time. Next, taken down by Tranku. And Kate taking Tranku. That's a good trade so far. This is a good start. Link already against Lustig, who is over above Kebab Shop, but Intrigue comes up after that call from Link. Lustig taken down. There's now four on two. Both players on Bravo. Jaeger taken down Kate, so just Jaeger left now. They know exactly where he is as well, so this is going to be a very hard time for Jaeger now. But it's absolutely needed for Veritas to get this one round. There's the there kill, we have it. indeed. Now, they may just, just. I mean, I do, I do prefer personally the insurgent side. I know a lot of people prefer the insurgent side on market, so maybe they have something special up their sleeve. But we'll have to wait and see. They do have one round to give away and take it to overtime again, but it's not really enough. And the half with the win. 7 to 1 in favor of Rubber Bandits. First to 9 wins. And if Rubber Bandits takes it, we're done for the day. I can go to work and get some food. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, it'll be really interesting to see if Veritas have some kind of uh, know, special tactic on the Insurgent side. They definitely need it right now. Oh, it looks like not live. Maybe they have... Uh, oh, Link seems to be FK right now. So just be waiting a couple of moments until he gets back and he's ready to go. Oh, rip Link. <laughs> yeah, he's probably popped a couple of blood vessels. So we're ready to go. Not ready. So, what can they do? Got any ideas, Freaky? N no, I'm <laughs> still. Any, I'm a got noob. Got any tactics for us? I'm a noob. No, nothing. Nope, I'm a noob. Not a noob, man. Yeah. No, no you're not, man. Come on. In this game, yes, yes, I am. <laughs> All right, so second half of round of map number two. Here we are. 
We are live. There's the scores. And boom. Here we go. Let's see what rubber bandits do for this one. Now we're pushing up street. Oh, that's they gave able to take out Link on the crossover. As Kate getting into position on Main Street was spotted, getting shot at now. As Nabo pulling out and getting into a new position. Ooh, frag comes out. Boom! Kate with a beautiful yeah, grenade. Like Both. Bogey in decides fact, to bogey take up the well. scope, actually, yeah. Maybe with being 7 1 up, he can. My goodness. He can afford to do so, but. Absolutely nothing on Alpha for Veritas right now. Next does have that flank covered, but still it be very hard for him to get back in the game right now. Intrigue. Oh, he looked away. Does he looked pop away. In. Right at the last second, Bogey looked away. Intrigue gets him. And Nabel has captured. So here comes Jaeger and Bogey back into the fray. Fans, DJ next, and Intrigue. Nice shot by Nabel. Taking out Intrigue. Fance is up next. He's overlooking the bridge. Gets. Oh, Nabble pokes for a second and Fance pops it. He goes down. DJ Nex and Tranku fighting each other near bridge. Little pre fire there. Tranku still giving chase. Boom. Tranku's taken out by Vance. Didn't even see him. 2v3. Favor of Rubber Bandits. Ooh, DJ Next is on B, taking some damage though. Bogey's trying to move up. He's got the sniper. See if he can get a shot off. Oh, he's so close. He knows exactly where he is. He's so worried about Charlie. He's so worried about Charlie and them having a free cap that he keeps looking toward there. But in all this time, Jaeger's made it all the way around the back and he's going to be coming up on uh, Next any second. It Next does take out Nex as well. Vance does spot one out on the left side of Bravo, but can't make the shots count. And this is looking like... Bogey knows he's Maybe up there. Maybe not, unless Vance has anything to do about it. Jaeger's so Wait close, he's just popping oh, around. There we go. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah, Vance was getting ready to toss a grenade right on top of Bogey, too. 